hello, Dr. Youngblood. I was getting this out as early as possible. I just got your email, so I'm setting this out right now. Um, my name is Adrian Ortiz. Hello. I'm from Philly. I'm from the Philadelphia area. I've lived in Philly, in Center City, South Philly, uh, the suburbs. So I'm just basically from Philly. That's what I tell people. The uh, second question was what brought me into this program, uh, specifically the scientific rigor, I would say, of my daily practice. So I, I've owned a nutrition coaching business before nutrition coaching was actually nutrition coaching. For, so for 20 years, I started there and I lived there. Um, I was one, one of the first people to um, investorize and trainerize, which is a huge platform. I was already building e-courses and LMS systems and apps actually like 10 years ago. So I was kind of ahead of the game when it came to using technology and digital um, programs to you know get more information out. Also, it's a great passive revenue stream. So um, I've been very successful in business and um, it allowed me the time and the space to go back to school and I really wanted to learn more and in a systemized academic setting than just learning things on my own. So that is what brought me in and I coach the way that this program is which is uh, looking at all of the as aspects of a human, not just food and exercise, but sleep, but their culture, how they were raised, um, their environment, their access to food. And that kind of brings me to the third question about social determinants of health. Yes, that is currently inside of my business right now as a practitioner. Um, one, all of our coaching programs, we have scholarships that you can apply for. Uh, I put away 5% of all of the income for that. And people, we do a lot of fundraisers and donations. It's really cool. So a lot of the challenges that we do, I run a lot of 21, 30 day like habit challenges. And um, what people do is they pay to play. And we then take that money and we um, use that towards funding someone, a family. So that's really cool. And also we have discounted um, programs for people and I'm also in the process of developing and we all I have a lot of free programs but I'm building a really great program right now called health foundations that's really really cool just getting some like core habits down which is basically like water sleep and um, just walking just some gentle movement some meditation so bringing that all together so yeah I apologize this might be a little longer than normal um, however I wanted to you know make sure I, I that now that I have my assignment I know what I'm doing to get on top of this as fast as possible I will send this to your email I obviously want to stay in class. Um, I'll get everything done that I need to get done. And uh, my apologies, I'm missing everything. There, was, there must have been a gap of um, communication between Gina leaving and assigning me a new academic advisor. So um, these are technical errors. I understand humans are humans and things can be a little, uh, when you're rearranging staff, I know things can get touchy. So uh, thanks for having me and I'll post this up.